Hey everyone, Animal Man here. Today we're going to do our first blacksmithing project together. We're going to take this normal railroad spike I've salvaged and turn it into a really neat bottle opener. This is actually going to be a uh, Christmas gift for my dad. So, this is for you dad. Here we go, stay with us. It starts to cool off fast. What we're going to do is we're going to start to just flatten just the tip of this. See what that did already. That one, that one's ready to go too. Usually I do projects, I do two at the same time, and that way one's in the forge, one's being hammered at all times. It saves time. It's more efficient, more efficient that way. And there's less time waiting. That way, as you're hammering one, the other one's always heating up. And also, if I mess up, I have two. Now we're going to use our chisel and a small hammer this time. We're going to start to cut through the middle and open up the middle of a bottle opener. It's important the metal is very, very hot while you do this, otherwise it'll crack it. It's starting to get too cool already. we got to put it back in there, heat it up again. Oh yeah, we're through. Flip over. Okay. See that hole now there. Daylight. Awesome. Now I just gotta make that bigger. See how wide that is now. Baby bro, baby brother. All right, we're just gonna neaten this up a little bit the best we can. Get rid of this little point at the tip.
nice and toasted toasty. Now we've got to make our little spot to catch on the bottle when we open our bottle. Now we're talking. All right, I'm gonna try this with a drill bit now. I have no idea how this is gonna go. Hey, it's, it's working. It's working pretty well, actually. We're gonna do something called a twist. We're gonna put a little twist in this baby. This is gonna be so pretty. I love how these look. Gotta be fast though. All right, here goes nothing. See what that did. Here we go. Just gonna brush all the all the ashes and scale off of them, and these are ready to cool down and test them. You have to do some fine tuning, but I think they're done. All right, well, here's the final test. Here is our finished um, bottle opener. Came out gorgeous, I'm very, very proud of this. I have not tested this before. I've had this kind of sitting there off to the side as my motivation for the past hour as I worked on this. That's how long it actually took me to make this. But I made two of them in an hour, so it's not that bad. And uh, here we go. <gasps> that was amazing. Cheers.